We're continuing to watch some clouds across the area. A little bit of light rain going to move in at times tonight as well. We're going to have some patchy, dense fog, some drizzle, a couple of showers. Just overall, not a very nice night. The steadier and heavier precipitation, however, is going to move in during the day tomorrow. That's the stuff that is still out there across the Appalachian chain. You can see some of that moisture, as we said, at times this evening. The big news, very blustery conditions, but very mild for this time of year. Made it up almost into the mid 60s today in most spots. And uh, as we go through tomorrow, we're going to look even warmer than that. We're going to start off not too far from 60. We'll look for some scattered showers early, then some periods of rain and temperatures we believe tomorrow will top out even a little warmer than we're showing here. We think around 70 degrees. Wouldn't even rule out a stray thunderstorm tomorrow. And look at the winds, very blustery again, uh, brisk out of the south at 25 miles per hour. Tonight, then 55, patchy dense fog, also some drizzle, even a couple of isolated showers. Tomorrow, 71 periods of rain, cloudy and warmer. And then the seven day is going to look like this. The high temperature on Sunday, excuse me, Saturday is going to be 60 or 61 coming off this high on Friday afternoon. So we'll be at 71 by midnight. Friday night, Saturday morning will be around 61 fall to 52 by morning. And then I usually I almost always just put the daylight high temperature on here. So the daylight high temperature on Saturday is going to be 52. But again, if you're out maybe Friday night party and it's going to be 61 for you guys for everybody else 52 and falling rapidly down through the 40s later in the day. Only 34 Sunday Martin Luther King Day, very cold compared to normal. And then late Tuesday into Wednesday, a chance for a little period of light snow potentially across parts of the region. A lot more coming up on that over the next several days.